I am not going to lie, um, as you can see, a lot of flame detail, um, I wish I could have done some red paint here, um, and if you can, you can sort of notice this, but it's like a swirly blue paint, which I like, because in the movie, Optimus Prime had swirly blue paint, but, um, yeah, not a whole lot of robot kibble, they did a really good job with that, as you can see, no robot kibble there, the only robot kibble is that you can see the arms in there. So, yeah. Very nice figure. Some nice silver metallic. Um. Silver. And I wish they could have carried that over to Smoke Sacks, but they didn't, unfortunately. Um. Nice little spinning tires. As y'all can see. Um. For the size comparison, there's Optimus Prime. And there's Bumblebee. And that is a nice little comparison there. I like it. Bumblebee is a tad longer than the um, Optimus Prime figure, but nah, what you want to do about it? A whole lot. But um, yeah, let's get this guy transformed into his robot mode. So first, what you're going to want to do come to the underneath of the truck and you're just going to want these feet fold up into a shin you're just going to fold that down just like so and then you want to come around to the flatbed of the truck and then you're just going to separate that just like so and um, once you do that the entire front of the assembly of the truck just folds down just like so and then once you do that you can swing the um, flatbed of the truck around just like so situate that that will become his arms. And um, once you do that, you're just going to situate his legs. And then his hip is on a ball joint. You just want to rotate that around, just like so. Once you've done that, separate his legs. Come around to the back here. This is a little lever, which he has a little gimmick. Oh my gosh, pop out um, Optimus head. How cool. But now, here we have the Transformers The Last Night Optimus Prime out and in his robot mode. And to be honest with you, this is one of the weaker of the modes. And, um, yeah. I mean, he lacks paint detail in this mode, to be honest. Um, as y'all can see, the only red in this mode is right here on the Autobot symbol. So, as y'all can see, you can sort of see the red paint detail up in there. You got very nice face work here. I'll give Hasbro that. But other than that, that's just about it for his paint detail. Um, for size comparison, here's the last night Bumblebee minifigure. As you can see, they're really in scale, to be honest with you. Bumblebee is a short guy in the movie. Still, powerful guy. I ain't gonna lie, powerful character in the movie. Set you off to the side. You're just gonna watch. <laughs> um, but yeah... He does have a bit of articulation. He bends at the elbow. His um, shoulder is on a ball joint, so you can get a good range of motion with that. His thigh is on a ball joint, ball joint, and that's it. That's literally it for articulation. So this is one of the weaker modes. But, um, yeah. Transformer back into vehicle mode. What you're going to want to do is come to the feet and just fold his feet up into a shin, just like so. Um, then you're going to, um, go ahead and fold his head down, just like so. That'll snap into place. Then you want to take the flatbed piece in his hands and just, or his arms, whatever you want to call them, fold them around. Do not snap them together yet, because you need, uh, another part will peg into that. And then you want to just peg the legs together, and you're going to want to rotate the hip around, and then just get the front situated. Once you do that, there is a tiny little peg right there. And there's a tiny little peg right there. And these two will, whoops, these two will peg together. Let's see if I can get it on camera. Yeah. Yeah. There we go, just like so. Do that the other side. And then these two pieces will peg together. There we go. 
this one. Now here we have Transformers The Last Night, Optimus Prime, back in his vehicle mode. And, um, yeah, he does roll pretty nice, too. I forgot to mention that in the beginning. Um, but, yeah. That's just about it for this figure. I hope y'all enjoyed this video, and if y'all did, make sure I leave a like, and, um, yeah, um, I'll make sure to bring more Transformer video reviews to my YouTube channel, and, like always, thank you for watching, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Goodbye!